we're we're sort of alike. You know, he believed in what he believed in. I believe in what I, I believe in what I believe in. And um, but he's still for a strong cause. And um, yeah, um, unbelievable, unbelievable man. Um, very very unbelievable. Ali is. Um, I mean, he's a legend. What else can I say? If you're invited, will you attend the gala? I know Aaron told me yesterday he plans to invite you um, on February 18th at the MGM. I can't Are you believe it. Make it? Aaron wanna, I'm going to make it. I'm going to print it tomorrow. Aaron wants to, see it in print. It's unbelievable. Aaron wants to invite me, but he, 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 he <laughs> don't want to face me May 5th. So it's, it's like I said before. This is unbelievable. I um, mean, only thing I got to say is, um, Bob, Aaron, let's make the fight happen. And I'm, I'm, you know, um, every day I'm tweeting, I'm tweeting, I'm tweeting, I'm tweeting. And I'm, I'm out here, chase, I'm basically chasing the guy. So you got to ask yourself, before when they said that Floyd Mayweather was ducking and dodging, did he really want the fight or not? Or it was just, you know, Bob Aaron blowing smoke up everybody's ass. Or did he really want the fight? You know, back in when Ali was in exile, Joe Frazier went to the people and said, get this guy a license so I can fight him. And he called Ali and helped. Would you call Pacquiao and do the same thing? Say, hey, dude, you know what? You and I, let's do it. And, and you know. Well, things work a little different, you yeah. know. I mean, things work a little different. This is the same. Uh, uh, they, they stand that they, they really want to fight, but then they got a lawsuit against me. I mean, let's really, is it really me or is it really them that don't want the fight? Mm -hmm. And more and more importantly, just to add on to what Floyd's saying, Manny Pacquiao don't call his shots. Floyd Mayweather calls the shots over here. Floyd Mayweather's his own boss. Manny Pacquiao has a boss. So if, if Manny Pacquiao wants to fight, he got to ask Bob Arum to make the fight. And Bob Arum has shown no indication that he wants to do that. What is the deadline? When do you guys need to know by? Well, what we're going to do. We're going to know today. Yeah, what oh, we're going to what, we, what we're going to do is. Want me to call him now? We, we put the pressure. We put the pressure on them, and the ball is once again back in their court. And um, so, you know, as Ford has made it perfectly clear on who he wants to fight. I, Ford, think, but I, I, don't, I don't mean to cut you off, Leonard, but Bob is unbelievable how he has been playing and with the media for so many years, making everyone think that it's me. All, I, mastered all that. I ask is one thing. I just want to be treated fair. I'm not I'm not saying, oh, I need this, oh, I need that. Everybody I've been fighting thus far had no problem with taking random blood and urine. I, had, I, I have no problem with giving random blood and urine just to show the world that I'm a clean athlete. And you know, when, when history is wrote, when history is written, when it's all said and done, they said, you know what? Floyd Mayweather was a clean, honest athlete. That's all I want. In, in my opinion, in my opinion, the, the main obstacle that the reason why, solely my opinion on why he hadn't made the fight, because this would be the, actually the first time that Manny Pacquiao was able to see what's in the pot of money. And for all the other pay per view fights that he's fought, he will see that obviously he knows that Floyd makes tens of millions of dollars more than he does. And he will look at that, in my opinion, and say, shit, all this long I've been underpaid. See, because the books will be open. That's my opinion, though. I mean, he's only stating, he, and literally he's stating his opinion. I mean, um, like I said before, you know, I'm, I'm hearing different rumors. I'm hearing different rumors about, uh, he said, oh, I got Benny uh, Pacquiao's guarantee. I got my own guarantee. I got my own guarantee, you know? I mean, tell me, you know, I'm only asking, what does it take to make this fight happen? All I ask Aaron, what does it take to make the fight happen? Well, you, you have a relationship with Todd DeBuck. Have you talked to him? And since you don't talk to Aaron, have you talked to Todd? Um, Todd, Todd is, is a uh, man, Todd, um, actually I texted Todd yesterday, and uh, you know, and I asked, just asked him for an email. And um, hopefully today I can call him uh, to try to make the fight happen.